All right, y'all, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Would you be mine? Would you be mine? It's a new day. It's Monday. And I'm actually surprised at the fact that I don't see no traffic right now since I just pulled off. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. I hope nobody never come outside. You know what I'm saying? As far as I'm concerned. Just bear with me for a second. <laughs> Try to get down there. Okay, somebody just... All right, I wanted to say something real quick. I know, I know some of y'all, some of y'all don't like that beeping, but you know, if you just, if you could just, if you could just ignore it, just ignore it. <laughs> but anyway, um, what I wanted to say is, I want to say, coming down here. In this, in this planet, on this planet, th th there's a price that you have to that you have to pay to come down this dream. And I'm, I'm, I'm you know, what I'm saying because you gotta understand that we, m m most of us, we don't, we, we come down here, we come down here, right? And uh, oh, I see, I see, the, I see them, I see them bots coming behind me now. They must be waking up slow, waking up late or something. Let me, let me, let me pause this video because I wanna, I wanna, um, let me pause. I'm gonna pause the video. Hold on. All right, I pulled over, got out, wanted to see nature real quick, but I just wanted to say, um, it's a price, it's the price to pay to come down this joint. Like we come down here, we get our mind swipe, you know. According to, you know, like I said, the gurus, they, it's like this spiritual contract that we signed to come down this drink, right? We spoke about this over and over and over. You know what I mean? Some people don't believe it. Some people do. But I, my thing is, for the ones that don't believe it, let's say if it's true. You don't, you don't remember. You see what I'm saying? So, well, let's just say hypothetically it is true. Because it, 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 I mean, why, why, why would, I mean, it don't make no sense. I'm not going. I can't sit here and be uh, caught up in no uh, no belief system that they raised me up on. You know what I'm saying? I, you got to think outside the box. So you got to be like, because you already know that the God theory don't make no sense. It's just it just don't make no sense for why God is sitting on the sky and just watching all this go down, and he ain't doing nothing. And then you know you be like, why why do I got to go through so much pain or whatever? The only even 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 thinking that. I did this. My higher self signed this contract to come down here, whether it was based upon karma or whatever, whatever the case may be, or based upon me just breaking generational curses in my lineage or in somebody else's lineage. I don't know. These are all speculations and, and, and questions that we had. Remember, we, we, we all suffered amnesia. You know what I mean? So, but the point is that let's just say Perhaps we did sign something to come down here to go through what we go through, but we just don't remember. You must understand that these these beings, which is these archons or these the reptilian entities that control this construct, they remember. They never forgot. So now, since you're down here and you forgot your mission, <laughs> you know what I mean? You down here, you forgot your mission. You at the club, you know. Shaking, shaking your tail feather, whether you're a female or a male or whatever. You had the, you're a male. You trying to mac daddy at the club with 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 with, with some Hennessy and Alize and you know what I mean and and Shorty over there dancing and stuff. You know, we we get sidetracked to um, what was our main calling of coming down here. You you was not you know you wasn't you you was on a mission. I mean, think about it. Think about um Malcolm X for example. You know, once upon a time he was he he had perms in his head. 
You know what I mean? He was out there partying and, and, and listening to that punk rock music and bad mouthing your country out there. You know what I mean? He was he was in the world. And then he got locked up. He got arrested, right? You know what I mean? And that was that was basically the beginning of his um transitioning, his his um transformation, his metamorphosis. You know what I mean? He metamorphosed from being in the world to being Malcolm X to of who he became. You know what I mean? So you cannot you cannot judge a person based on what they've been through. Sometimes that makes you, you know, become who you are. Most of the time that does. You know what I'm saying? You gotta go through something to become something else. I'm me, my, my I'm a perfect example of that. You know what I mean? So but the point is is that we on this mission in, in this higher realm, in the spiritual world, we were like, okay, I'm going to come down this joint. Because I heard Bobby Hemmings say this one time. He was like, man, we've been in the spiritual world talking crap, man. I'm going to go down there. I'm going to go down to the Matrix. Send me on down there. I'm going to take over that joint. And then when you get down here, once they put you in that brain, they get you in that baby brain, and you got to start all over. You're walking around, you know, defecating in your diaper. You know what I'm saying? And, uh... You a baby, you're a toddler, you don't remember who you was, you know what I'm saying? And this is another reason, too, why why children, when, when babies come into this realm, you notice in the very beginning of the, of the phases, babies are are so connected. You see, That's why every time when I see babies, I'm like, hey, baby, what's up? Where'd you come from? You know what I'm saying? What, 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 what galaxy, what, what, um, what, what, what solar system you came from, you know what I'm saying? Because they're, they're fresh from that spiritual world. They just left it they just got here and this is another reason too why why the beast will sabotage the baby too you know what i mean they would you know give you those um those injections and stuff like that you know and they lie to the parents they lie to you they lie to the mom say oh it's good it's it's for the it's for the it's for, it's for the child's benefits it's going to strengthen the immune system you know take these take these uh these, uh, you know, I got to watch my words, you know what I'm saying? Take them right now. Just roll your sleeves up and take this needle in your arm, you know what I mean? <laughs> and we being gullible, we just believe the crap. But then at the same time, these same people that believe the crap are the same Christians, too, that be like, ah, I don't believe in the devil and all this stuff and stuff. But you fall for the devil's trap over and over and over. You, and that's because we don't know who the devil is. They done deceived us into thinking that the devil is some spookism guy in the, this red suit running around in the spiritual world, you know. But your devil is right there, right in your face, telling you to take that shot. You know what I'm saying? So, and this is the reason why they do that with the babies. This is the reason why they got to sedate you over and over and over as a child because they, they know that you're tapped in. They don't, they don't want you to remember who you are. They want to take, they want to, they want to, because it's bad enough they didn't already swipe your memory, right? But you got to understand, too, a lot of, even though when they do the swiping, a lot of kids come into this realm still remembering their past lives. You can look it up. There's a whole bunch of kids out here, you know what I'm saying, that remembers their past lives. You know? Every time when I talk about past lives, my mom, she, she just, she cannot, you know, comprehend it at all only thing she know is jesus on the main line tell him what you want he, he shed his precious blood he coming back again that's the only thing she know he don't do nothing else you know what i mean but you gotta you gotta know one thing like i said this is the this is the reason why the beast spends all this money he don't give a damn about no money he gives a damn about your ass he gotta make sure that you don't wake up you that, that's the whole mission is to keep neo sleep you see what I'm saying? So, so I mean, speaking of Neo, what happened when Neo started to wake up? You know what I mean? They, they, they those agents appeared in in Neo's dream and said, "We, we, we got, we got information." You, you talking to the boy Morpheus? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I mean? He lived in two worlds. He was living a world in the Matrix, and he was living another world in the, in, the, in the spiritual realm. But we, but we're putting in work. All the people, you know, that's going through this gang stalking, you know. You know, we, we are fighting the battle. We're not just fighting the battle down here in, in, in this in this physical aspect. We're warring in the, in the galactical forces as well. Whether you believe, you know, believe it or remember it or not, it's going down. You see what I'm saying? So so my point is what I'm saying is when I said that um, it's a price that we pay when we come down here because I was just watching this video and it was talking about this dude. I forgot, I forgot his name. 
And he said that this guy right here had the science down pat. You know what I mean? About how this is a holographic universe and, you know, everything is fake and stuff like that. And they said that the Gov, the Gov had kidnapped him because he went missing. You know what I mean? He went missing because he had so much, so much deep knowledge that he they, 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 they was afraid. You know, he had that classified information that they didn't want to get out to the public back in the day. So this dude mysteriously went missing. You know, nobody know what happened. But that's that's the that's what I'm talking about. There's a price that you gotta pay when you come down this joint. Everybody, just look at all the people that has something to give or offer to the to the people, to the population on a positive level. Something always happens. You know what I'm saying? Something always happens. We, we you can you can just go down the line from Malcolm X to um Bob Marley, the, um, you know, so this is another reason too why they control the music because they don't want spiritual people controlling the airwaves. It's just that simple. Ephesians chapter 2, Ephesians chapter 2, it says that the prince of the power of the air and all that stuff, you know, what I'm saying it's talking about that's, that's the satellites, the frequencies, the, you know, the beast is controlling the airwaves, what you see on TV, what you hear on radio. They control all that. They, you know, what I'm saying so they ain't no way in the world they'll have somebody that got knowledge and information that can wake up the people they're not they're not gonna have you you know you know blowing up in the music industry or 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 you know doing good movies and making movies and stuff like that and dropping this science and this knowledge to wake people up this is right this is the reason why you know they control everybody you got to be accepted and initiated into their boulets and stuff you know what i'm saying and that, and that way when once you once you enter their family now we can mind control you we can probe you we can clone you. We can do all these crazy things. So that way, if you get out of, if you get out of, uh, if you're trying to do a Kanye West on us, you know what I'm saying? We're just going to, uh, we're going to, we're going to kill you off or some, or, or either gang stalk you. Cause that's what they doing to Kanye. They, they gang stalking him. You know what I mean? So, but this is a price that we pay, man, coming down this joint, you know, being woke. You know what I mean? You know, we're just a part of this resistance. We are the resistance. And we just, you know, and, and they know it. You know what I'm saying? They know it. The beasts know it. The archons, they know it. They know who you are. They don't want you to know. That's the whole name of the game. They don't want you to know. They know who you are. They know that you're Neo. And they would do anything and what whatsoever to make you stay asleep. <laughs> That's, I don't give a damn if I got to spray the sky, if I got to jack up your food, give you Monsanto, whatever. It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? They would do anything. They would spend billions and trillions of dollars to keep you sleep. To keep you sedated. As, as I'm speaking, it's just a bunch of red white cars riding past. But, you know, like I said, you know, this is what the, 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 the so-called, I don't like to hate the word chosen, but God's elect. Put it that way. You know, God's elect. We, we, we are definitely on a mission down this joint. Everybody is at different phases and different stages of their awakeness. You know what I'm saying? Some, some of y'all still stuck on Jesus on the main line. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's cool. You know, you, you, sooner or later, hopefully you'll grow out of that and wake, you know, wake up and go to another level. I was down there before. I was on that level before. So I understand where, where, where y'all at. I was there. Once you, once you, once you study further... You continue to research and study further, you will, you, will, you will advance and get out of that level. You, you know what I'm saying? It's like upgrading a phone. Speaking of that, I need to upgrade my phone bad. You see what I'm saying? Let me upgrade you like Beyonce. You know what I'm saying? Everything is in stages. I don't, I don't get me. I get a lot of people, you know, and I know a lot of them are just bots in the comment section. You got to believe in Jesus, brother. You know, they do it purposely. Because they know I don't believe in that stuff. So they just send these bots. Because I, you know how I know that it's purposely done? Because when I go on other Christian targeted individual channels and they on there talking about Jesus and stuff, you know, saying get saved. And then there's a whole bunch of people in the comment section talking about Jesus don't exist, buddy. You're wrong. Blah, 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 blah. Religion is man-made and all this, you know. So I know, I see what they do. I see what they do. You see what I'm saying? Since I don't mess with religion they send a bunch of religious people around me the ones that mess with the religion they send other people you know um non-religious targets you know or bots or whatever on that channel and it's the same um like since um since like i said since i'm a heterosexual you know what I'm saying for those that don't know what that mean that means a man with a woman you know what i'm saying 
what they would do is when they send females around me, they usually would send either a bisexual woman or a straight gay woman. You see what I'm saying? That's what that's just what they do. I'm just telling you. you now I mean, so I'm gonna go get some exercise. It's like I don't know what time is it, like eight o'clock? Not probably almost nine a.m. Whatever. I'm gonna go get some exercise. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to just, you know, get that off my chest real quick. And I just wanted to say that because, you know, coming down here, it, it, it ain't no easy task, man. It really ain't. You know what I'm saying? And some people say, some people say, man, you know, like I realize, you know, it, whether, you know, it's two sides to the coin, right? It's all about polarities, right? So I realized that, you know, even when I was asleep and when I was asleep, you know, life wasn't easy when I was asleep. Okay. I still had it hard. And I realized that because I was always the apple of God's eye. So that's why they was targeting me even before I even woke up. That's how I know how deep this is. You know what I'm saying? Even before I woke up. I'm talking about, I'm talking about I was being targeted even when I was out there in the world. You know what I'm saying? Going to the clubs and drinking liquor every day and, you know, running around acting like a fool. I was still getting harassed by police. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All the time. Back in the, we talking back in the 90s, man. You know what I mean? The 90s was off the chisane. You know what I mean? So, so I was, I was, I was going, I was always going through it, even before they turned all the bots against me, the people, but I was always going through it with law enforcement, you know what I'm saying? So, so that right there always let me know that this was a spiritual thing going on, you know what I'm saying? Because why were they always targeting me? And I wouldn't even, you know, this was even, I wasn't even getting into nothing. I was chilling. Look, I used to get harassed by the, by the, by the pigs back in the day, man. Look, I had everything I had, because, you know, I was working, I was young, but that was another thing too. You know what I'm saying? I'm, here it is. I'm 17 years old, driving a car, you no know, my car, you know what I'm saying? You know, I had a good job, money, you know what I'm saying? Um, living a good life at a young age. So so when the cops saw me, and, you know, in the hood, man, they used to pull, they used to pull me over and lie, said that, oh, man, this car is stolen. I'm like, man, this car, this is my car, you know what I mean? Once they ring it up, ring all the tags up, you know, everything's in my name. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, they felt stupid, but they used to do it. They used to, they used to, man, they used to, man, back in the day, man, they used to always target me. So this, so what I'm going through ain't nothing new. It's just enhanced. That's it. It's just on steroids now. So, so this, this is the reason why I always tell people, I'm like, if you're a real targeted individual and you're being tracked and tracing, blah, 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 you've been one. You've been a T.I. You just didn't know it. You've been, you've been a T.I. You see what I'm saying? It, it was hiding from you the whole time. The archons knew who you was from the from the from the rip. They already knew who you was. You know what I mean? They and like I said, they'll do anything to make you to to, to keep you sleep because they don't want you to to wake up and realize that you're a god and that you got the power. And this is the reason why they on you. You know what I mean? They're not on you because you believe in no Jesus or, or no Yahweh Shai, nothing like that. They on you because it's a bloodline thing and you're a god and you got superpowers. They know that. You know what I mean? You, everybody, we all possess something. You know what I mean? So, and this is the reason why they on you. You know what I mean? Because um, that's just the way it is. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, and Jesus told you that you're God, and he said you're going to go out there and do more miraculous things than I did. That's what Jesus said. Don't read your Bible. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't call me crazy. Read your Bible. You crazy for not even reading the book that you claim you stand on. So, so with that being said, y'all, Y'all keep your heads up. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. You know what I mean? Come outside, get some nature if you can. You know what I mean? You ain't got to go to the big cities if you don't want to. Just come outside, walk walk down, find yourself a trail. Find yourself an environment that look like this. And go ahead and unwind. Because that's what you need to do in this world. You know what I mean? Just, just give all that stress to the trees. The, 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 the universe knows how to take it. You know what I'm saying? Just, just hug a tree, take your shoes off, walk in the grass, walk in the water, whatever. Smoke a spliff. Do what you got to do to get that stress off your chest. Because you don't want that stress going to lead to anxiety and, and a whole bunch of other crap. You don't want no health problems. You know what I'm saying? So we, we, we go through a lot as being a T.I. We, we go through a lot as being a T.I. You know what I'm saying? And the average Joe go through a lot just being on this planet. But but if you a T.I., you know what I'm saying? You already know that everything is on steroids. <laughs> you know what I mean? Everything is on steroids. My mind just gaslit me to my... Um, I be I be sneaking out. I'm like I'm like I'm like I'm like. What do you mean I'm sneaking out? Like, like like she trying to make it seem like she don't be knowing when I'm leaving or whatever. I'm not. Man, I'm, I'm like yo. These people, man, around me, man. They're so full of crap, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like they lie. Everything they come out of their mouths is lies. You know what I'm saying? Like you know damn well. You know where I'm at.
These people, not only do they know where I'm at, but they know where I'm asleep or if I'm woke. Whoa. They know. They know. Trust me, they know. If you're T.I., you know what I'm talking about. These people know when you sleep, they know they is like Santa Claus. They know when you've been bad or good, so be good for goodness sake. Santa Claus is coming. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, these gang stalkers are Santa Claus because they watching every move you make. You know what I mean? So, Frosty the Snowman or something. So with that being said, y'all, y'all keep your heads up. We out this joint. Player, player, look at the red truck. Look, 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 look. <laughs>